What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Of course, you know it's Atlanta's number one hip hop station, Hot 1079, and home for the morning hustle. Yours truly, Behind Radio Shouty, in the building with me right now at Birthday Bash ATL 25. I, I got tripping. my Texas fam in this down day. Head down, pop the it, pop it. Hey, man, I just want to say I watch Behind on YouTube every day. I know how he answer questions. He asks questions like a concerned parent. It's that's how you make people really just just spill their guts. You be like, yeah. So when they was beating you down and <laughs> and taking your chain, how did it feel, man? Club that's how God, get, how get you spill your guts. We gotta get into this thing though, man, because you know what really caught me? I was on Instagram sliding through that thing, and then I saw where you was at Clark Atlanta University years ago, grinding. Passing out them tapes, passing out them CDs. How do you feel to be gracing one of the biggest stages in the country tonight, man? Hey, man, it feel good. I always want that love out here in the A. Yeah. I remember they used to charge me to get in DJ booths. My God. You know what I'm saying? Like, so it's just number love out here now, man. Just when you think up. about your wave, though, man, all of the different artists that you're working with now from 2 Chains, I mean, Erica Banks, I'm seeing all of the new features and songs going up at the same time. Hey, How man. you feeling about that, though? Hey, man, it's just dope. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. it's, it, it, I'm happy, but it's more of a feeling like about time. Yeah, too, yeah, you know I feel saying? that too. So, you know, it's, it's dope. Uh, B-King, dope. them challenges, man. <laughs> them challenges make Instagram my Instagram won't let me live, man. I I'm mean, too turned up for the ground, man. <laughs> I had the shortest challenge ever. It lasted one day. Oh, my God. In Instagram flagged me like four times. I said, man, I ain't, they ain't finna do me like Boosie and give me a body of <laughs> exactly. man. I said, let me go on in this challenge right now. I need my page. Exactly. You know For real. What you got coming up next, though, Beat King? The album. The album is called Y'all Late. Because everybody that discovered me now, yeah. after all this TikTok fame and all that, they late. Because in Texas, I've been on that for 11 years. You know what I'm saying? So, Ask yeah. the club guard, man. Club Godzilla, I ain't tricky. <laughs> What is it like when you hear these clubs and these folk going crazy? And then also, no, tell me about that one show when you went in there, you kept it real, and it was just you showing up. No, I did that on purpose. I got to this club. Yeah. It was like this little city next to Baton Rouge, you know, where NBA Youngboy from. It was like, yeah. like about an hour away from that city. Yeah. And it was nobody in there. And oh it's because the promoter didn't do his job. Yeah. So I say, man, people love seeing negative stuff, so I'm just going <laughs> to post it because I know it's going to go viral. And yeah. it did. You know what I'm saying? But I did that because I know who I am. I have sold out shows every night. So I posted that show. It was empty. The next day, it was a sold out show in the next city. That's why I did it, just to be funny. Well, see, my thing is, Beat King, when I look at you right now, I feel good because you have that story that came from the bottom all the way to the top. What is it like maneuvering at the top heights of hip-hop right now when you got everybody trying to get a feature, everybody on the track now, and you can do no wrong in this thing? Man, honestly, man, you just got to cut your phone off sometime. I ain't going to lie, man, because on the weekends, they be kicking my ass on the weekends, man. So when I come home during the week, yeah. I'm only in town like Tuesday, Wednesday, sometimes Thursday. So I try to get my daughters them days and try to go to the gym. Yeah. And after that, I ain't got time to be worrying about nothing else. So pretty much the weekend, that's rapper. That's B-King. And then during the week, I'm Justin. Talk to me you know about that gym life, though, man. Getting healthy. What was it that made you say you need to look like LL in this thing? Now? All right, number one, stop playing with me. I don't look like LL, number one. <laughs> number two, I just got tired of being on stage tired. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> well, you've been in the game long as me. I got like an hour show now. And yeah. That's when I get around to that fifth song. I'm like, <sighs> y'all make some noise. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm like, man, forget all that. You know what I'm saying? So I just trying to make a change, you know? What that shirt saying today? Oh, man, the shirt say, females with good head, always busy. <laughs> That's why I came with this band. They're always somewhere practicing it. Ah! <laughs> Getting better. You know what, what are the females saying when you hit the streets and then they seeing your shirts, they seeing the movement? Are they just going crazy every time Club God touch down? Man, I've been doing these shirts like this my whole career. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, it's a part of my uniform now you yeah. know what I'm saying people are reading the shirt before they even read the caption on my picture on instagram you know so it's basically like a tattoo yeah you get to know who you're dealing with yeah <laughs> before i even open my mouth with these shirts you know what i'm saying so answer me this club god what was the craziest thing you done seen a female do when the beat king touched down on the scene man is this youtube this is everything this is Hot 107.9. Oh, okay, I'm just saying. All right, the craziest, Say what you feel. The craziest thing I done seen, I was in St. Louis. Yeah. And then 
I started rapping, and then four girls started eating ass in a row. <laughs> I think it's still on Pornhub. It's on Pornhub. I heard. Oh, my God. I ain't put it on there, but, yeah, they was eating ass in a row. Okay, now, what's going through your mind when you seeing that? I'm just like, man, that's filthy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yo, it was funny. I still recorded it on Snapchat, you know what I'm saying? But I did a lot of stuff. I started the cucumber thing. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Recall. I started that. It's just when Trouble and Boosie and them did it, it with, with that platform they yeah. had, it went super national. You that's know what right. I'm saying? But I started the cucumber. That's what made Uncle Luke follow me on Instagram. Damn. So I've been out here. Getting it in. You know what I'm saying? So, Lastly, before I let you slide, man, what you about to do on this stage? What we need to be expecting out of the Beat King tonight, the club guard? What's happening? Not much. They gave me five minutes. Ah! <laughs> I'm finna get up there. Hey, y'all. <laughs> Drop that beat. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Straight up. Beat King, man. Appreciate you coming through this thing, boy. Wish 100, you the best much success. Appreciate you, Radio, shout it. Club Godzilla, Beat King in his thing. Hey, it's hey. out 1079. We gone.